Hello everyone. In this session, we'll discuss fourth question on axioms of probability. So this question is a die. A die is rolled twice. What is the probability that the sum of the faces is greater than 7 given that first outcome was 4 first outcome was greater than 3 first outcome was 1 and first outcome was less than 5 so there are two dice and or i can or you can say there are uh, there is a dice which is rolled twice it's all same so when you are rolling it once you can expect 1 2 3 4, 5 and 6 and again rolling it second time you can get 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 right so we want that the sum is greater than 7 I can I'll say d1 plus d2 should be greater than 7 what are the possibilities for the values The sum can go from 8, 9, 10, 11 and 12. These are all possibilities which have to be achieved. So, the first case is when D1 is 4. The first outcome was, a, was 4. So D1 is already 4, what are the possibility for D2 so that the sum is greater than 7? If you take 1, it will be 5, the sum will be 5, 2, the sum will be 6, 3, the sum will be 7, 4, the sum will be 8. So we want 4, 5, again the sum is going to be 9 which is greater than 7 and 6 also. So these are the numbers which if comes on D2 it will give the sum to be greater than 7 so the sample space for D2 is I'll write it here sample space for D2 is 1 2 3 4 5 and 6 of which we have 4 5 6 right so that means the probability that sum is greater than 7 given the first card is 4 let's say s is equal to d1 plus d2 will be how many numbers 3 out of 6 so this is 1 by 2 second case is when d1 is greater than 3 D1 is greater than 3 which means D1 
कैन बी फोर फाइव और सिक्स राइट फोर फाइव और सिक्स नाउ वट इज द प्रोबेबिलिटी दैट दी दैट डी वन इज फोर इज इट वन बाई सिक्स नो वाई बिकॉज द नंबर इज ग्रेटर देन थ्री इज ऑलरेडी गिवन इट इज अ कंडीशन दैट द नंबर इज ऑलरेडी ग्रेटर देन थ्री सो इट कैन बी इधर फोर फाइव और सिक्स इन दैट केस गेटिंग डी वन टू बी फोर विल हैव अ प्रोबेबिलिटी ऑफ वन बाई थ्री अगेन डी वन इक्वल टू फाइव विल हैव अ प्रोबेबिलिटी ऑफ वन बाई थ्री एंड डी वन इक्वल टू सिक्स विल हैव अ प्रोबेबिलिटी ऑफ वन बाई थ्री राइट बिकॉज नंबर इज ग्रेटर देन थ्री सो देर कैन बी ओनली थ्री नंबर सो दिस इज द न्यू सैम्पल स्पेस एस वन दिस इज द न्यू सैम्पल स्पेस वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स इज नॉट द सैम्पल स्पेस एनी मोर वी हैव द न्यू सैम्पल स्पेस एज फोर फाइव सिक्स ऑफ विच फोर फाइव सिक्स कैन बी वन बाई थ्री वन बाई थ्री एंड वन बाई थ्री नौ इफ डी वन इज फोर वॉट आर द पॉसिबिलिटी फॉर डी टू वी हैव ऑलरेडी चेक डी टू कैन बी फोर फाइव सिक्स आउट ऑफ वॉट आउट ऑफ द इंटायर सैम्पल स्पेस वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स राइट सो द प्रोबेबिलिटी विल बी आई राइट प्रोबेबिलिटी विल राइट इट टूगेदर and if d2 sorry d1 is equal to 5 then d2 can take it it can take 3 also 4 also 5 also 6 also because it has to be the sum has to be greater than 7 so 3 plus 5 will get give 8 so 3 is also included 4 5 6 already included because if 4 can give 4 5 6 to be greater than 7 definitely 5 can give it If d1 is six, then d2 can be two, three, four, five, and six. Because six plus two will give you eight, and anything more than that will give sum to be more than eight only, right? So now, probability that sum is greater than seven, given d1 is greater than three, becomes Like each of them have the probability of one by three. Like which one? D one equal to four, five, six. So it is one by three into for for D one equal to four. There are three cases out of six cases. Four cases out of six cases, and five cases out of six cases. So it is going to be three by six plus one by three into. Four by six plus one by three into five by six, right? So this is how much? This is seven plus five, twelve, and then this is one by three. Right? This is twelve by eighteen. Two by three. C option is when the first outcome was one, so D one is one. Now, for the sum to be greater than five, D one equal to one requires the second number to be at least seven because one plus seven will be greater than seven. So this is D one. This is D two. But can we have D two the second? Uh, and the second rolling can we have this number 7 the answer is no so probability that the sum probability that the sum is greater than 7 given d1 is equal to 3 sorry d1 equal to 1 is actually 0 or null now d option is that d1 is less than 5 so it can be 1 2 3 or 
right now this is again a conditional probability what do you want we want proba sum to be greater than 7 given d1 is less than 5 right now d1 can be 1 2 3 or 4 and again the probability of any of this number is actually 1 by 4 in general I'm writing 1 by 4 why because the sample space has reduced this is the new sample space we can have only 1 2 3 4 we cannot have 5 or 6 why because the condition is the number has to be less than 5 so probability of getting 1 is 1 by 4 probability of getting 2 is 1 by 4 probability of 3 is 1 by 4 and 4 is also 1 by 4 then we'll check for this sum to be greater than let's say d1 is equal to 1 then d2 cannot have any value for sum to be greater than for sum to be greater than 7 if d1 is equal to 2 d2 can be 6 6 plus 2 gives 8 we cannot have anything other than that if d1 is equal to 3 then d2 can be 5 and 6 both and if d1 is equal to 4 we have already done this it can be 4 5 and 6 right so probability that sum is greater than 7 given d1 is less than 5 will be sum of all these cases plus 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 so what is this this is d1 probability of getting 1 as d1 is 1 by 4 probability d2 will be into 0 then plus probability d1 is equal to 2 is 1 by 4 into d2 is equal to 6 so that is only one number out of 6 so this is 1 by 6 then probability of d1 equal to 3 is 1 by 4 and two numbers out of six one out of one two three four five six we need five and six so this is two by six and then this is one by four into three by six so what we are getting is like if we, if I take one by four common this is zero plus one by six plus two by six plus three by six so this is 6 by 6 equal to 1 and the answer will become directly 1 by 4 so this is probability that sum is greater than 7 given d1 is less than 5 right so this is the answer